And now your weather with meteorologist Gino Recchia. Temperature of 34 degrees today. In our normal, we should see 27. Record high, 51 back in 1894. So now we make it 42 of the last 49 days. And then tomorrow will be 43 of the last 50 days that will be at or above normal. Beautiful sunrise today. And finally, how about that sunshine? It feels great after dealing with a lot of cloudy skies over the last couple of days. But the clouds, they're coming right back in here as we head into the evening hours ahead of a next clipper that will move in here. 29 degrees, winds coming in out of the west at 12 miles per hour, making it feel 10 degrees cooler outside right now. We've got upper 20s and lower 30s across northeast Wisconsin. 30 degrees, Kiwani, upper 20s in Appleton, 28 in Watoma, and 30 in Pembine with the winds coming in out of the west and southwest at about 5 to 10 miles per hour ahead of our next weather maker. Here the cloud cover building in here from the west and moving eastward as we speak. We've got snowfall right now moving over parts of Minnesota. This is a clipper that's going to be traveling eastward and providing us with a little bit of snowfall overnight. And it looks like the arrival of it will be coming here probably after 3 a.m. or so for our western tier areas and then getting closer to about 5 o'clock in the morning as we get to around uh, the Fox Valley and eastward towards the lake shore. And then another system farther west getting close to making its impact along the Pacific Northwest shoreline. That system could be affecting parts of our area as we get into Wednesday and Thursday. So far this season, three and a half inches of snowfall. We should be seeing just under 13 inches, so we're more than nine inches below the normal for this time of the year. The least amount of snowfall we have seen since 2015, which was at this date, only two tenths of an inch of snow has fallen. But things will change as we head into the overnight. Cloudy skies, and then as we get to about 3, 4 o'clock, you're starting to see a little bit of that snowfall moving in here from the west. We get to about 7 o'clock, a little bit of snow, perhaps a slight wintry mix building in here. But as temperatures rise as we get into the mid-morning, early afternoon, that's where we could have a better chance of some of this snow turning over into a little bit of a rain-snow mix. Accumulation is not going to be a big system, but just enough to coat the roadways and the grassy surfaces, a dusting to an inch. Some areas in the far northwoods could be clear, uh, closer to about more, near two inches of snowfall. Now, the system on Wednesday into Thursday, there's two areas of low pressure. How they're going to fuse together into one system remains exactly the question. Uh, here's kind of one of the type of forecast model agreement showing the area of low pressure occurring farther to the north. And what that would do is keep us in the warm sector, heavy snows up into southern Canada, and then a little changeover as we get into Christmas Eve with maybe a light dusting of snow. So no major snow if we do see it coming that way. 27 overnight with a little bit of snow moving in here. Then for tomorrow, we'll get up to a high of 36 with snow transitioning over to a wintry mix. 35 on Tuesday, uh, mostly cloudy skies, 41 on Wednesday. And then we do cool off quickly Thursday and Friday before rebounding in the weekend. Still ahead on